Jorge Pablo Valdez, which from 77 to 80, he was the number one cocaine dealer in the world. Okay? Jorge uh, uh, Luis. Jorge Luis, Luis Valdez. Jorge Luis Valdez from Cuba that moves to Miami, gets his degree. Then one of his clients that's a uh, market that they have every month, he's depositing $500,000 saying, how do you have this kind of money? He says, listen, we don't do this kind of stuff. This is just this, you know, stuff that we have to hide. We have a cocaine business. And back then, you know, he was killing it. He made like $60 million. He's 21 years old. Cocaine Cowboys has a documentary about the guy. So I said, what was it like being in Cuba? He says, in Cuba, he says, you know, you couldn't believe in God. You could not believe in God. Why couldn't you believe in God? You know, the whole concept of communism, you can't believe in God. The state is God. The state is God. The whole concept with Hitler was what? You cannot believe in God. It's, it's who? It's I am your God, yeah, right? State. Hitler is your God. And Dietrich Bonhoeffer uh, wrote about this. You know probably the story of mm-hmm. Dietrich Bonhoeffer. It's a great story, Kai. That's another book you got to wrap up with Dietrich Bonhoeffer. So this guy stood up to Hitler, and Hitler couldn't stand this guy and what he was doing. The moment you, if you really want to control the populace, the first thing that's got to go is believing in a higher power. The moment you get rid of that, you don't believe you can go fight a bigger opponent, okay? Mm-hmm. And this book, Naked Communist, written by Cleon Skousen, which was a 15-year uh, CIA agent, and he wrote about a certain steps. One of them was indoctrination of the LGBTQ overly. Listen, we all know somebody that's gay in the family. Everybody has somebody. And you're like, yeah, listen, I've known since you were, I don't know, you, you've been like this for a long time. Right. So it's not like it's, you know, it's like, hey, what's up? It's cool. No problem, right? Everything's fine. But the overly of trying to get you to question those thoughts of how do you know maybe, what if not, what if this, you're starting to see some of those, th- those things. One of the things is faith, get people to stop believing in God. Because once faith is gone, people don't believe they can fight against the system. This is the other one. There's a lot of different things that they're going through as well. Everybody's equal. There's like 25 steps they're going through. Gradually, this is taking place. So if you enjoyed this little short segment from the podcast that we did, here's another short segment to watch. Or if you want to see the entire podcast, click over here. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.